missing part. There's missing animatronics. Did Banana kill his friends and turn them to bananas?
over. We all. Creepy pasta life. Um, yeah, you can become a creepy pasta. Um, la la la. You think creepy? Some people think there's a pasta that is creepy, and it's like, and it's no, that is not it. Okay, SCP six eight two is my favorite SCP. Oh gosh. Ah, what do I do? La 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 la. What the heck? Hello. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't like being shushed. This is why I hate being put. Oh my gosh, this is not what I meant. <clears throat> Sorry, I missed. Okay. okay. Sally. <gasps> to be my enemy. Okay. okay, there is, that's just SCPs. Hey, 
please spend more. Oh, shit. Cute. Hoodie. Cool. What is this? The big core again. Just him. For the cool guy. Can't even. Um, I'm gonna become the Demogor again. Yeah. Yep, I know what is it. Uh, Possessed. Oh my bloody torso. No! Ha 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 ha. Yeah, it's just boring. Um, well, the wall's straight down. <laughs> yep, this is, this is so scary. Um, Azari, um, Samaya. Who is <laughs> Hello, 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 hello. I am smiled. Okay, okay. Okay, this is embarrassing, so yeah. Holy moly, can you please stop? Virus, um, what the heck? Stripes. Sally. Jane the Killer. Charlotte. Judge Angel. <laughs> this is my favorite one. <laughs> <laughs> I was Jack, Nina the Killer, Rainbow Jack, Laughing Jack. Why would you choose Laughing Jack's face? Oh, Papa's sister. Been drowned. Okay, what is this? Now say, uh, Dr. Smiley. Jason the Tormac, Kayiko. Okay, Queen Zack. Scarecrow. Zero. Oh, and last one, Lulu. Okay, um. Remover. Okay, that's just delayed my whole face. Cool. Uh, holy shit. Oh, I have a little. I tried. That's great. Freaking you out. I'm 
not sorry. Not at all. Not. Ah! Ooh. I'm so not scared. I'm not scared of this. My whole hair. Her judgment and make our own creepy past. My first creep. Like that idea. Yes. Um, where's my hair? My hair is gone. Uh, I have to find that. Oh, here's bloody paper. <laughs> my first creepy pasta. Or or PDA. Okay. I turn this to black. Oh, what's that? Ugh. Ooh. Uh, Okay. I wonder why. Your face or hair, okay. I wonder what 
Mouse, mouse, fuck. Oh my gosh, the human form is so disgusting. I wonder if, I, if I still can morph into Smile Dot. Oh yes, I can. Yay! I can't wait! Yes, yes. Pet remover, I don't care. Hello! I am Smile Dog, Jeff the Killer's pet. I want to see the story of Smile Dog. Okay, let's see it. The story of Smile Dog. Hello. Welcome to a new Draw My Life video. Hey there, TikTokers. We are very happy to celebrate our channel Draw The Life Tic Tac has reached the 500,000 subscribers. Yup, it's been a year and a half already since we started this project with the video of the twins Lisa and Lena. Since then, we have shared many, many Draw My Lives of characters, mythology, TV series, curiosity. Who's killing me? Are you trying to stab a dog? and a lot of terror with the spooky videos of our Scary Tuesdays. We want to thank you for all your support, comments and messages and in love throughout this whole time. Okay, I'm gonna be... okay, okay. You are the best. Without a doubt, we will keep working hard to publish new content. And to celebrate this great achievement, we have prepared a very special video where we will introduce to you two characters we are sure you've seen in many occasions. Tick and Tack. Do you want to know more about their story and how they ended up in our channel? Stay tuned, we will soon reveal the mystery. And thanks again for always being there. Here is a new time and set the date up. In the beginning, Mary agreed, I was just an experienced writer searching for ideas for a novel. When I got to the house, I couldn't see Mary. She had locked herself up in her room. Terence and I stood in front of the room's door. She talked and I took notes. Even though I couldn't see her, I knew she was crying. <laughs> Mary talked without making any sense about her horrible nightmares. I decided to leave. I didn't want to bother her. Her story was very tough. In 1992, she was working as a software developer for an important company. That was the year she found the image Smile.jpg and her life changed forever. Mary was one of the 400 people that saw the picture, but she was the only one who talked openly about the experience. After the event, she could barely leave her house and she had to quit her job. It was in 2005 that I found out about the existence of this picture through internet forums that talked about paranormal cases. Lots of people knew Smile.dog existed, the creature that supposedly appeared in the Smile.jpg picture. Mary was the most mentioned victim in all conversations. The other people affected have remained anonymous. Or maybe they disappeared. Actually, there was no credible information, all the phenomenon was focused on a picture that can't be found anywhere. Though there were many imitations and fake copies around in forums and through chain emails. Witnesses stated that once you see it, you suffer immediately a sudden epilepsy attack and a severe anxiety. All the supposed victims gave the same description of the picture. A creature that looked like a husky in a dark room lit only by the flash of the camera. The only detail they could see clearly in the background is a human hand. The hand isn't holding anything, but it seems alive. The dog has shiny eyes and a big gloomy smile, showing two rows of teeth, very white, very straight, very perfect. When you see it, you suffer an epileptic attack and you never forget it. The dog comes to the dreams of the victims that have seen the original picture until their final days. After the failed interview with Mary, I decided to keep researching, but everything led me to a dead-end street. A year after, I received an email from Mary that got me totally by surprise. 
I'm sorry about my behavior last summer. See, I've had nightmares about a smile dot dog every night for 15 years. I know this might sound absurd, but it is the truth. In my dream, I can't move. I can't talk. I only look in front of me and the only thing I see is that scene in the picture. I see that hand and I see that dog. He tells me something. He tells me I have to share his word, show his picture. I didn't understand it. Where was I to get it from? Soon after, I got a floppy disk in a mysterious package. I didn't need to see what was inside. I already knew. I considered my options carefully. Who should I show it to? If that smile dot dog was faithful to his word, I would sleep peacefully again. But at what price? What would the consequences be for those people that saw it? I decided not to do anything. For 15 years, I hid the floppy disk. All these years, a smile dot dog invaded my dreams. I ignored it. I ignored his request and it's been a torture. When we set up the interview, I thought about giving you the floppy disk. I didn't know you and you were so desperate to know more about a smile dot dog. But I saw you arrive through the window and I couldn't. I locked myself up in my room. I don't want anyone to suffer as I'm suffering. Please, stop your research before it's too late. Sincerely, Mary. Mary died not long after I received that email. I talked to Terence, her husband, and he told me he had burned the floppy disk. He said that while it was melting, it sounded as if it was growling, as an animal. I have to admit, I wasn't very sure how to react to all this. In the beginning, I thought it could be a practical joke, but just in case, I decided to stop my research. Soon after, I received another email. Hi, I found your emails in forums about a smile dog. I saw it and it's not as bad as people say. Here's a copy, spread the word. I was paralyzed. I felt I was going to pass out. The email came with a document attached, of course, named smile.jpg. I thought about that one. How was it? No, I could hear. But assuming the picture is authentic, was I really gonna risk all those lives only to save myself? Could I do such a thing? Yes, I could. Could. It turned into. It was a little cute puppy. Do this! If you enjoyed this video, he's smiling and in a demonic way. Simply of a common interest, people would often use it jokingly, like in. I'm your biggest fan, I'll follow you until you love me, Papa. <laughs> I'm your biggest fan, I'll follow you until you love me, Papa. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey guys. Welcome to my channel. Is not. Mary reported her miss and rather called her psych. She owned a dog, and one night Mary heard the dog continuously barking, which was not normal with her dog. It sounded scary to her. Mary went to look if her dog is fine. She was right behind the dog, and there the smiling dog turns around his head and gives the creepiest smile. She screamed and ran to her room. She was surely scared to death. It was creepy scary which was giving a whore a smile at her. The scariest part was it was barking, but still giving that scary smile look. She ran and locked herself ah. in. The ah. thing with this smile dog is once you see the dog's face, it will keep haunting you until your death. It's something like it has possessed you forever. Every night she used to get this nightmare of smile dog, and worse was that she never found her pet dog again. It was sure that the smiling dog might have killed it, it remained a mystery forever.
She used to write a blog and share her horror experience that she was going through. No one took seriously until it was noticed that many pet dogs went missing and from the same home deaths were reported. Some theories were shared, quoting the smile dog has different abilities. It first kills your pet dog and leaves you in horror forever. It shows its original form at night. The first sign is it starts barking and it wants you to see him. That's when the nightmares get started. We have heard many horror stories of such creatures, but this is acting differently. It hunts down your dog first and gives you nightmares forever. She wrote everything about this day and her nightmares in the blog, and sadly she died one day. That nightmares killed her. Later, the blog got famous and people started thinking about it. After a few incidents, they became aware. It has also been reported that some children went missing while playing. They were last sighted with the dog, which clearly did not belong to anyone. This has terrified people. One pattern was noticed. The dog goes missing and the person dies of a heart attack. When Mary's blog was getting noticed, then many realized that there is one monster who lives with them. All were terrified and started guarding their dogs. But the smile dog is evil and the creepiest one. He doesn't need your door open to get in. He can enter from anywhere because he is the creepiest with the creepiest smile that you have ever seen. We're making you aware of it, guys. We want you to be safe because there is this monster lurking around you in the form of dog and it is ready to give its one look to make your life living hell. So guys, that was today's horror story. Please. Oh my gosh. When you look upon me, your mind will begin to unravel and your sanity will fleet as your hopelessness and fear expand beyond your wildest nightmares. <laughs> Every time you close your eyes, you will see me. Every time you try to cover your ears, you will hear me. And every time you tell yourself that I'm just a figment of your imagination, I will destroy something in your life to remind you that I am very much real. <laughs> you humans have come to call me Smile Dog. And when you see my face, you better pass it along or your very sanity will be ripped to shreds and your fleshy body will follow shortly. So screw- Oh my god. I'm with her Hi there, peoples. Hmm. Okay, guys, but like subscribe and smile dog is. Cool.